As Congress veteran and a former footballer, N. Bidin Singh dribbles past Ibobi Singh for the Chief Minister's chair. There are growing rumblings within the Manipur unit of the Congress as they complain against the central leadership of the party. Many senior leaders in the Manipur Congress say that they feel betrayed at this point in time, given the fact that facing very high anti-incumbency, Ibobi Singh, who was in power for three successive terms, had to fend for himself completely. Senior leaders in Manipur Congress say that despite their insistence on the party high command to send them all sorts of logistical help, there was very little that came in as support from the central leadership. Therefore, be it funds, be it other election related engineering, it was all up to the state unit to fend for themselves faced against a BJP juggernaut which already has Assam and Arunachal Pradesh in its kitty. The BJP on the other hand came fully prepared with a robust electionary campaign with all senior leadership coming to the state to campaign led by Prime Minister Narendra Modi. On the other hand, despite the Congress local leadership's insistence that the senior leaders come to Manipur to campaign, none of the senior leaders came here for the Congress party except Rahul Gandhi who reluctantly came and addressed just one rally in Imphal. Compare this to the BJP, they had senior leaders like Prakash Javrekar, Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Nitin Gadkari and Amit Shah camping here and not just in Imphal but spreading across Manipur and going to even the remotest of areas to campaign for the party. And therefore, even though the Congress has managed to bag 28 seats, they fell short of three to stake claim to form the government as BJP gets its third northeastern state in its kitty.